Several U.S. senators are slated to make the Perkins Loan Program a focus when the Senate reconvenes next week. For the first time in 57 years, the proposed government budget doesn't include the program. Wisconsin Senator Tammy Baldwin says the exclusion will hurt those who need it most. But Tennessee Senator Lamar Alexander says the loan would cost $5 billion over 10 years, and he believes it's not as effective as others. He's in the process of consolidating the government's existing loan programs into one and says students who currently have loans won't be affected. But Baldwin worries about students who will want to apply next year. This is a uh, loan that is targeted at low-income students um, that often makes the difference between whether they can get the preparation they need for um, the careers of today and tomorrow, and we need to reauthorize it. The federal Perkins loan program helps about 500,000 students.